Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you're all having a great day so far. So if you want to find out what my very special news is, you might have a little bit of a hint here from where you can see so far, then please do stay tuned and I will go into a lot more detail in the next clip. So guys, as you know, I have been following Slimworld for 36 weeks now. I am over the moon to tell you guys that I have been awarded a very, very special certificate today. Now, I have done a previous video similar to this in the past, so I will just take this opportunity whilst I can before I get too excited, because I can feel it all bubbling up inside, is to ask if you are not a subscriber already, if you would consider subscribing to my channel. It really would mean the world to me. The progress that I have been able to make with the support of all of you guys at home is second to none. The growth of this channel without the support of you guys would be nowhere near where we're at right now. And I owe it to every single one of you at home watching right now for the support that you give me and the time that you give to watch my videos. It really does mean the world to me. I cannot stress that enough. So again, my wonderful members who may be watching right now, uh, I absolutely love every single one of you. I am so grateful for all of the support that you give me the special shout outs as well on some of your videos is fantastic and of course the lovely comments that you give me on a day-to-day -day basis. I cannot thank you all enough but I would love to see more of you as members so please do have a look at the members tab on my um, YouTube main page, um, sort of home page and it will tell you more about the different, like, different levels of membership tiers that will be there to suit every single one of you, whether you want lots of support or whether you just want a little bit more of uh, personalised content as well, then please do take a look at those options. Thank you so much. So, first of all, we will go into what award I've been given. So I was a little bit embarrassed, which did take me by surprise. I don't generally get too embarrassed. Um, but I did find out that I was made to stand up in front of the whole class at about half past seven in the morning when I got weighed to get my lovely certificate, which is The Greatest Loser 2024 for my group. So The Greatest Loser is where you have been awarded the person who has lost the most weight in that group and I am honestly literally blown away by all of this here so this is what it looks like Ooh, so excited I did not ever ever think that I would be awarded this um, there are people who have been target members in my group for many many years now and of course I don't know how much weight they've lost in total and I didn't expect that I would be the person who had lost the most amount of weight so far to date, which was just great. Um, but what I will do is just grab the um, the other certificate thing here that I've got that I'll speak through with you as well. But just as a reminder, the video I was speaking about beforehand was Miss Slinky. Um, so I have been awarded Miss Slinky and I've also been awarded The Greatest Loser 2024. So. I just feel blown away to be honest. Um, with Miss Slinky as well, I didn't even know it was a thing. I didn't even know this was a thing. Um, only in the last couple of days have I seen people on Instagram posting photos of their certificates and I didn't really think or look too much into it to be honest. But what it does here is says that there is no need to pinch yourself. It's all real. You're staggering achievement. You've transformed your shape your healthier body and the inspiration that you are to everyone around you. Love every minute of this with my admiration and love, Margaret. So Margaret Miles Bramwell is the um, the chairman and she's also the founder of Summer World as well. And Summer World, as we know, has been going for well over 50 years now. And uh, I am really honoured to have this certificate um, I do have my Miss Slinky one as well, which I'll just grab for you guys. Give me a wee second. This is the Miss Slinky one, which I've got as well. Um, so yeah, this was awarded to me in my old group, uh, which was round about November, December, I think. Jeez, it might even been earlier than that. I've lost track. But basically, Miss Slinky is where you are voted for by your peers in your group. 
So there is a, a Miss Slinky and a Mr Sleek and uh, the group members vote for whoever they think is most deserving of that title. Now you do get a certificate of course, you also get a little sticker that goes on the back of your book. Um, I do have it but I've not actually got my book on me. Rookie mistake. Um, my book's through another room. But I will show you in the next video as well. But it is just a sticker on the back to say that you have been awarded the greatest loser. And of course you get your lovely sash, uh, which I've pinned down here with my microphone magnet uh, just to keep it in place because it keeps sliding off. Um, so yeah, I was really, really proud to get this. Um, just feeling a bit overwhelmed with it all. It's been a really emotional couple of days. Um, I've had a lot of really positive news, um, thankfully. And yeah, it's amazing. Um, so yeah, I think it does make up for my weight losses having felt slowed down a little bit over the last few weeks, but it just goes to show that your positivity, your tenacity, your motivation and your consistency is absolutely key to ensure that you get the results that you want. It is just fantastic to think about where I am right now compared to where I was last May. Um, some of you may have seen photos before, but I was in a very low place. I wasn't happy. I wasn't healthy. I had no energy. I couldn't get in and out of the bath. And I can now walk, run, skip, jump, wherever I want to go. Um, I can go to the gym and do an hour straight of cardio if I wanted to. I can keep up with my husband out on a walk. Um, James is six foot two, six foot three. Um, I'm foot five foot eight, five foot nine. And of course, he's got a lot, lot longer legs than me. He also walks very fast. But the fact that I can keep up with him and enjoy going out for a walk and it doesn't feel like absolute agony anymore, then these are all massive positives that you just cannot underestimate. So what I will do is just pop this aside and I will just speak about this here. So I'm not sure if all of you guys will have been given one of these yet, but please ask your consultant if it's something that you're wanting to take part in. So basically what it is, is a Slim World food um, competition. So basically it's relating to the free food festival that has just started with Slim World at the moment. So it's about celebrating what your favorite free foods are and how using free foods in the right way can give you a lot of feed, food freedom so that you have great losses without having to restrict any food groups and without having to deprive yourself because at the end of the day we all know that if you do deprive yourself you're more likely to completely go off piste and gorge on food that you feel that you haven't been allowed to eat for whatever reason. So this here is a recipe competition entry form so for everyone who does enter will get a certificate and you will get a sticky as well for your book. So I don't know whether this um, will take place online as well, um, but please do speak to either head office or speak to one of your consultants as well in group if you want to find out more about it, because I don't really know much more. Um, but it is relating to making up a free food recipe. So basically what you have to do is put your name, your phone number, your email, your consultant's name and group and time. And then you have to attach a photo of your finished dish, if at all possible, with the name of the recipe, how many servings it makes, the ingredients and quantities, the method and the cooking time. And it has to be sin free. So the whole point of this is if you do win the competition, I believe that it, it is done locally um, in each group and then nationally they will look at one the, the winners of each group, I believe. And I think this is how some of the dishes come into Food Warehouse, for example. So if it's been a winning dish, then it would be made, um, you know, on a, a much greater scale by Slim World's uh, food production team. And they would then put it out for purchase for the general public, which is fantastic. So I have got a few ideas here that I would like to write down. Um, I'm not going to share them yet because I'm not sure, but I will put my ideas down here. And I will submit my entry form because I really want the certificate and I also want the little sticky to say that I've taken part. So regardless if you win, you've taken part and that is so important. It's also really important to have a think about what your most favourite meals are. Can you make them free or do you eat them free already? Can you make any simple tweaks? And can you also make up a delicious dish that you can make using free foods that you may or may not have tried before? Is it that you can take your most favourite calorific high sin dish 
and make it very low sin or free, which would be ideal for this competition as well. Who knows? But I love coming up with recipes. I love just throwing things together and seeing how it turns out. But I do have a few ideas up my sleeve. So please stay tuned. And of course, it's taking part that counts at the end of the day because we're all taking part in group every week. We're all showing up. We're being accountable. We are being mindful of our food choices and we're being mindful of what our budget is and how we can tweak our food choices to match our budget and vice versa as well, because that is incredibly important for sustainability in your weight loss plans and journey. So I'll pop this aside, um, but what I will do is just have a little bit of a chat with you guys now about what we discussed in groups. So the consultant Angela went round everyone and she was asking what our favourite food group uh, was from our fee food. Was it proteins or was it, you know, carbs or was it fruit or vegetables, etc.? For me personally, I think my favourite free food would be eggs. Um, and the reason for that is that they're so versatile. So I'm sure a lot of you at home may agree with me as well on that. But of course, you can have them for breakfast. You can have them as a side with your breakfast. You can have them as a boiled egg snack on the go. They're full of protein. There are very, very little to no carbs involved with the eggs. They're filling. They keep you feel fuller for longer. They don't spike your blood sugar. They are full of nutrients and minerals. You know, there is so much good within an egg that, you know, it is like a whole food um, and it's, it's really, really good for you. There is, and there has been chat about cholesterol and eating many eggs, but actually that has been proven incorrect. So if you do want to look into that, then there are lots of research articles and things online um, regards your cholesterol, etc., linked to eating eggs. Um, of course, if you don't want to eat a lot of egg yolk, um, you can eat a lot of egg whites. And you can also make up a larger portion of eggs using some eggs and the rest the rest whites as well to make it a much bigger portion without adding in the extra calories. Of course, eggs are free on Summer World, but it is always mind, it is always good to be mindful about the portion and the amount of food that you are uh, you know you are eating and consuming. I can't speak. Um, but yeah, eggs. So eggs for breakfast, eggs for snacks. You can have an omelette. You can have scrambled eggs with um, with cottage cheese stirred in as well to make it really high protein. You can have, you know, a, um, an egg wrap. You could use it as a tortilla base. You could use it as a bit of a pizza base if you topped it with your sort of favourite pizza toppings instead of using a wrap or instead of using bread if you wanted to save your healthy extra, and of course some sins as well, depending upon which one you use. Um, you know, the, the options are endless. I mean, there's just so many different things that you can do. You can also make some light um, snacks, like meringues with them. You can always use the eggs to make custard. Um, and there are lots of great ideas and recipes on the Summer World app and the website as well, if you did want to look into making some sweet treats using eggs in the recipe too. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope this has been helpful. Please let me know in the comment section below what your favourite free food is and what your favourite free meal is. So that would be lovely to hear from any of you guys at home who are following the Summer World Plan. And even if you're not, please just let me know what food you enjoy the most and why. We all have very sentimental reasons for liking certain meals and certain dishes, certain restaurants, and of course, certain cuisines as well for certain reasons. So it'd be lovely to know a little bit more about you guys and what you enjoy the most of. So thank you so much for watching. Please do take care and I will catch you on the next video. Thank you. Bye.